Hey, Virgo Sun Rising Venus. This is what we got going on for March 3rd, 2022. If you'd like to make a purchase, you can go ahead and do so at tarotbarbie.com. I got crystal sage incense, personal readings, and much more on the website, tarotbarbie.com. The reading special is still going on for the next couple of hours. For anyone who's interested, tarotbarbie.com. Let's get it, sweeties. Coming with the Three of Cups, the Empress, and the uh, Hangman in Reverse. All right, Virgos. It doesn't look like it's the best energy, to be honest with you guys. But at the end of the day, I'm going to go ahead and read these cards first before I even get into the energy. So, uh, Page of Cups energy right there, which is teaches a strong astronomy and the values of herbs and precious stones. So, Virgos, there's a very sweet person here who teaches astronomy, who teaches about crystals, um, <laughs> a very spiritual person for that matter with this owl part with this owl card there this is somebody here virgos who is very much so spiritual who's a very honest spiritual person at the same time with the page of cups all right and they teach they 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 very very much so value uh spirituality in every uh in 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 every way and there's a lot of people here who are trying to steal this page of cups energy with attempts thieves to steal serves as an excellent familiar so these people here are trying to steal your energy they're trying to steal what you, what is very much so for, familiar to you they're trying to block you at the same time they want to take what's rightfully yours you guys have to make sure that you guys are always going to continue to protect yourselves at all costs and and to simply just take care of yourselves here virgos at the same time these people want what it is that you have you guys come in as a page of cups so you guys might be new to the game you guys are still learning but that's what they think they think that you're new to the game all right that's what these people here think they think that because you come in as a page of cups that you don't show yourself to be better than anybody and no one's better than you you humble yourself very much so and because of the fact that you come in as such a sweet a spiritual person here you want to you want the world to be better you come in with the owl because virgos as young as you guys might be feel or you guys act in certain in areas of your life you guys have the true wisdom within yourself and people are wanting that from you they want to steal that away from you they don't want you to have it they want to have it all to themselves because they're selfish as fuck and the five of wands is people are in a lot of competition with you they're trying to dominate you here too teaches languages causes earthquakes overthrows politicians and clergymen returns those who have run away so anybody who thinks that they're going to be able to get away with the shit that they have taken from you through spell work magic witchcraft whatever Okay, if they think that they're going to be able to get away from it, they're not going to be able to. The same demons that these people are working with, are they going to be the same ones who are going to fuck them up? On a real note, uh, Queen of Swords, Virgos, all right? Teaches a geometry, measurements, increases one's intelligence, can transform a person into a bird. So you guys literally come in as a peacock. You guys are beautiful like a peacock here, Virgos. And you guys straight up bloom. You speak up. You say what you want to say. You speak your truth. You're a peacock. This is definitely Virgo energy. Even though it's the Queen of Swords, it's definitely a Virgo energy. Uh, you guys really show yourself and really show uh, your aura your guys are really um, how do you want to call it you walk into a room everybody notices you exactly what it is that you guys do in your daily lives no matter where it is that you guys go you guys are always blooming no matter what Virgos look how the peacock feathers are just blooming like that that's because that's a you dad that's your energy at the end of the day and people are hating that about you how how come Virgos are always shining and you guys are always going to get your justice for everything that these people have done to you if they think that they're going to be able to get away with it no they're not Justice is going to be in your favor they're going to have to pay back everything that they've taken from you they're going to have to pay back everything that they have stolen from you they're going to have to pay back Every, anything and everything that they try to take from you, trying to hinder you, trying to block you from your success, trying to block you from being able to prosper, trying to block you from being able to uh, send out collective messages to the divine, blocking you from being able to be you, blocking you from being able to be uh, of divination at the same time. Tell how the angels fell. Uh, reveals the past, present, and future, teaches a liberal science, right? And for that, that's justice on your guys' hands because of the fact that you're trying to show on on a whole other level of consciousness on a whole level teaching people on a whole other level of consciousness and people can't stand that and for that virgos you guys are always going to get justice in your favor here so good for you guys virgos at the bottom of the deck you got the four of cups see what these people are trying to do they're trying to steal or fetch as anything requested including money and horses reveal secret things 
brings questionable familiars. People are going to begin to see who these people are for exactly who they are. There's no more sugarcoating shit, Virgos. You're all going to find out what's going on and who these people are at the same time. And look at them. It's all because they're selfish as fuck. They're going to want to win at all costs. They want to defeat everybody. They, if, Even if these people are already at such a high seniority in life and they're doing the best and, and everything like this, they still want more. How much more selfish can you possibly be that you would want to take out somebody who's still who, who's who's getting into the game, who's trying to learn, who's trying to teach and who's trying to do something positive. And then you already at a very high familiar and you still want to take from fucking other people. Watch when your carpet gets dragged from under your feet and you lose absolutely everything. Five of swords, Virgos. These people think that they're going to be able to get away with it. And no, they're not. No, they're fucking not. These people are going to end up hitting tower after tower after tower. And there you go. Judgment's coming in on these people as well. Uh, distur distributes, promotions, and high offices causes one to be liked. You see, these people want to be liked for at all costs. They're going to do whatever. They're going to say whatever. They're going to have to act like however, dress like however, just to be liked. And that's why judgment is coming in, Virgos. They're going to be judged for it. And uh, spirit is not having this uh, at all it could be even people at a workplace setting with the eight of pentacles uh turns water into wine and back again turns blood into wine turns any metal into legal tender coins make fool makes fools wise so virgos these are people who are, might be very skilled with what it is that they do and there you go magician card at the same time all right gives health financial prosperity connects one safety one safely to with divine so you guys are definitely divine beings here virgos but these people are not and they continue to do spell work on you guys uh to steal from you to take from you to steal your energy at the same time and they are going to be receiving a tower that's going to be coming into their life they're not going to be able to get away with this at all uh promoter of discord war arguments falsehood gives generous responses so you guys are the ones who give generous responses you guys are the ones that are able to help humanity and all of the collective while these people are trying to disturb destroy you they want you to be the tower they want your whole world to be destroyed they want everything that you are creating for yourself to fall and tumble and to be dragged out but they're going to be the ones to have to suffer this tower because of the fact that they're wishing that on you and one more they have nothing but bad shit coming to them nine of swords and there you guys are going to find out exactly what's going on who these people are these people have cre created so much battle for you so much obstacles in your life so much trying to hinder you trying to cause you pain for real virgos these people really look at you like you're oh you're definitely a warrior but these people are looking at you like you know what you're a target for me and in order for me to have to wipe you out they're gonna have to do spell work on you they're gonna have to steal your energy because these people don't have gifts within themselves and if they even did they wouldn't have to harm, harm and hurt other people to be exactly where it is that they're at one more virgos let's see what this one is the world card virgos it's going to be over just now and uh, makes one skilled in labor and crafts these people didn't do nothing for you except teach you how the fucking game works these people are your catalyst virgos everything that was so bad for you became a lesson for you you took all those bricks and you built your own fucking tower temple you build your own fucking temple. You build your own frigging castle. Exactly that tower. How they? You see that tower, Virgos? Where did it go? Where did that tower go? <laughs> you see how you build this for yourself? They want to destroy that, right? So the same bricks that they threw at you, you're you're building with it. And they want to take that shit the fuck down. All right, Virgos, let's get it. Coming with the Three of Cups, the Empress, and the Hangman in reverse. Someone's rituals are absolutely blocked. 100% two of swords three of cups there's an empress energy who continues to do spell work on you guys this is somebody who's at a very high regard this is somebody who oh, wants everything for themselves this person's been keeping an eye on you but they are suffering with a lot of pain and a lot of regret for the shit that they're, they're that they're doing towards you their spell work is not working anymore with the three of cups or the two of swords. It's blocked. That's it. It's not going to work anymore because this empress here, all they they're doing everything out of negativity and they're continuing to waste their time on somebody that they shouldn't even be wasting. If you're going to be doing something, why are you putting so much negative effort into somebody else when that person's not even thinking about you? When you're fucking with a spiritual person and you hurt them, believe me when I say you are nothing for them. 
They nothing you. They don't hate you. They don't like you. They fucking nothing you. They nothing you. For you, Empress here, this whoever this Empress is targeting at the moment, that spiritual person who's the Page of Cups, who's doing, who's full of wisdom and who and who's very cute and loving and humble and the whole nine who just wants the world to be at a better place they fucking nothing you you empress you're nothing for this person here you're going to continue to have to sit there and watch this empress you're going to have to continue to sit there this empress has to continue and sit there and watch you and while they're watching you bloom and be happy they're going to end up becoming so sad and regretful and at a loss and crying because their shit's not working anymore their rituals are not working anymore their spell work is not working anymore this person is so selfish and they only think about them fucking selves it's the most selfish shit i've ever seen this person is about to get cursed virgos four cups in reverse they're creating bad omens for themselves at the same time because they continue to make foolish decisions with their life with the lover's card in reverse they continue to do bad things as well and they have nothing but bad luck coming towards them and bad omens i wouldn't even be surprised if uh, animals of bad omen animals started showing up in this person's life just so a spirit and 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 just spirit alone gives this person uh an opportunity to see what they have created for themselves all right they're gonna try and do everything they can to walk away from the situation because now the tower is coming in for this person with the tower card magician ten of wands and the knight of cups in reverse they're pissed virgos they're upset they're abusing their power over and over again and that tower came out in that reading and now the tower is coming in, in this reading here as well they're continuing to abuse their power the same shit that they're doing on you the black magic the witchcraft the whatever whatever the fuck it is that they're doing to harm you and put you in danger that's the shit that they're going to end up falling into themselves tower card virgos and this person's going to end up becoming so pissed they're even going to blame this aries leo sagittarius man they may even blame them because they're all seemingly to be working together with the queen of sword king of wands empress energy and this person's trying to have all full force all power here too with the strength card and you guys are looking at these people like what the hell's wrong with you why are you acting like that oh oh now now you can't sleep now you can't eat and now you can't do nothing anymore because of the fact of what because you continue to project negativity because you want to stay at this high em at this high empress energy and you think that you want to win at all costs for the fuck for what if you're already doing so good in life what are you worried about a next person for why don't you just go simply be happy with your life and go be proud of yourself for being able to be at that high empress energy instead of fucking looking down on other people thinking like no you're going to be the number one you're only going to be number one and there's nobody better than you and in order for me to 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 stay at this empress energy i have to destroy everybody and anything that tries to come in my way because i see everybody as competition that means you're a fucking problem you need to start looking within and trying to figure out why you have to feel that way about yourself and why you have to come at people like that too. So now this person is blaming this Aries Leo Sagittarius. Therefore, they're getting bad karma too. They're not, nothing's working out for them. This person's going to be losing a whole lot of money. These people have spent a lot of fucking money on you, Virgos. They have. They spent a lot of fucking money. Nothing's working out for them anymore. Ace of Cups in reverse. They may even end up getting sick or even getting a cold, whatever you want to call it. Seven of Wands in reverse. They're not protected at all. They're not protected whatsoever. They think that they're good. They think that they're protected. They think that whatever it is that they're doing is something positive, but they're no, it's not. It's the Hierophant for a while. This pe these people are going to end up all fucked up with the Ten of Swords. They're trying to hurt you and harm you with the spell work that they, it is that they're trying to do. They're trying to hinder you. They're trying to steal your energy. They're trying to fuck with your life. They don't want you to be happy. They don't want you to be successful. They don't want you to send out the messages that you guys are trying to fucking put out into the world for all the tarot readers that are out there who are literally doing divine work and who are anointed for 100%. This is all dark fucking magic and a lot of people are involved in this type of click on a real note and you're all going to start blaming each other with the Queen of Swords King and this person's going to be really, really upset. King of Wands, he's going to be pissed the fuck off because now that you guys had made whoever this energy belongs to, this Empress energy, whoever is asking this King of Wands for help, they can't help you. Because what you're doing for them now is you're fucking with their life at the same time and I'm pretty sure I said this in our meeting about a year ago. The one person who's asking other people for advice or help or whatever, you're just going to bring your whole clique down. You really are. You're screwing yourself up and you're screwing other people's lives up at the same time. All because of what? Because you want to continue to be the empress? Because you want to be able to be the one who's, you're better than everybody. And listen, when you're, if you're humble enough, you'll always know that you're not better than anybody and nobody's better than you. We are a humanity. Everybody comes onto this earth plane to fucking hustle, to do their thing, to want to be something, to set 
set goals for themselves. So you set a goal for yourself to come into this earth plane and to try and fuck with people's life. The fuck you mean? The fuck you mean? You're disrespectful. You're rude. You're disrespectful. And you need a reality check with the Empress energy. You think this Hierophant's going to be able to get, get you what it is that you need? No, he's not. No, he's not. I'm sorry to say it, but no, he's not. Uh, he's making a lot of mistakes with the Nine of Cups. He's going to be losing a lot of money. And there is no hope here for the wicked. No hope. Uh, Star card came up on the side there, Virgos. Nobody's going to be coming in for this. Hierophant, this Empress, this Queen of Swords, this King of Wands. No fucking way. It's not going to end up happening whatsoever. You guys are beautiful light workers, Virgos, coming with the Queen of Cups to the Sun card. Believe me when I say your happiness is right around the corner. And they tried to do everything they can to make you turn dark. They did everything they can, Virgos, to make you turn dark. And you're never going to turn dark. You're going to continue to stay to be a light worker. You're going to continue to stay to be a white witch. You're going to continue to stay humble, compassionate, loving, earth angel energy. You're going to continue to stay true to yourself. And that is the most important thing. You're not going to allow low vibrational people to make you be something that you're genuinely not. These people got a lot of shit, bad shit coming towards them. They're going to start losing their money. They're going to start losing their success. They have a lot of imperfections that are coming into their life because of the fact that whatever it is that they're doing, divine is obviously not on their side. And even with the darker cult energy that I'm reading with, they're also not fucking with their energy anymore because they continue to harm somebody who's not harming them. And they're going to have to suffer a whole lot coming with the Eight of Swords energy. A lot of suffering is going to be coming in. This could be a workplace. And the Eight of Pentacles came out in the other reading too. And they're going to have a lot of karma that they're going to have to pay up on. Maybe around, uh, how you call it, during Saturn retrograde energy in July, you're going to be suffering. Uh, and, and expect your work shit to be going pretty much down the drain. Uh, full out, Virgos. Uh, the planet of Pluto is definitely going to be bringing in a lot of destructive energy to a lot of people who are not willing to change themselves to be better for that matter to be better for that matter. And these people are nothing but tricksters. They're nothing but tricks, Virgos. They want to steal from people. They want to take from people at all costs. They don't care who it is that they're going to have to do it from. They don't care. Page of Pentacles. You guys hold something very dear to yourselves that people fucking want, right? And they're just going to come and they're going to continue to try and get other people to help them to try and fuck with your life. Yeah, Virgos. Be careful. Be careful. <laughs> and they're going to be left out in the cold with the five of pentacles some of these people may end up sick maybe even homeless maybe having to go to shelter at the same time they've done everything they can to fuck with your energy with the nine of wands battle like what the fuck they're trying to battle you for what <laughs> okay and uh you know eventually they're gonna have to move away from the situation but for whatever reason i see that there people could be potentially crazy at the same time and they may even want to try to come at you like that too so please be careful virgos and the four of swords judgment card all right, just spirit keeps telling these people with the four sword energy, yo, stop it, retreat, take a fucking break, rest. What is your problem? Why do you keep doing this to the to this specific certain person? What is your problem? And these people don't want to listen to the divine because these people are not of divine. These people don't believe in fucking sins. They don't believe in that shit. Four of swords, judgment card, and spirit keeps telling them, yo, move on with your life. Like, what are you doing? Just move on with your life. You have other things coming towards you, but at the same time, they don't want to. Otherwise, Virgos, you guys are going to continue to move on with your life. You're not going to be worried about these people in any way, shape, or form. There could be an Aries Leo Sagittarius here coming in heavy for you guys, Virgos. This person wants to win at all costs. Almost as if this person loves you and hates you at the exact same time because you guys continue to stand in your power. You guys are divinely protected with a judgment to the Queen of Wands. You guys are absolutely fine in every way, shape, or form, Virgos. You guys have a lot of new beginnings coming towards you guys, a lot of wealth as well. And you guys are going to continue to be that spiritual person. There you go. Look, 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 Virgos. High Priestess, Page of Cups. You guys are going to continue to be the high priestess that you guys are. You guys are spiritual. You guys have a lot of wisdom. People, a lot of people come in and they like to underestimate you, not realizing who you are and what your power is and what you are capable to bring onto this earth plane here. You come off as a page of cups. You come off as somebody who is, who's young, who's sweet, who's loving, who's kind and caring and spiritual, but they don't really act because you guys don't really like going out of your way to tell people you're a high priestess because you're fucking humble. You're humble enough to fucking not tell people that. There's no reason for people to tell, for you, anybody to go around and be like, I'm a high priestess, I'm a high priestess. That's just not fucking cute. Why are you boosting yourself up in that type of way? Yeah, you're gifted. Okay, cool. So, 
you guys are never going to go out of your way and let the whole world know that what you, what it is that you guys are. So you guys come off as the page of cups and a lot of people like to underestimate you for that specific reason and they need to stop doing that with you because this person here is an empress. So whatever this empress here is doing, who's getting other people involved in the shit that they're trying to plan on you, they're all going to suffer all in one Virgos, all in one. Uh, <laughs> two of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, and your spirit guides are going to fuck them up. Knight of Swords energy that's your spirit guide virgos they're coming in during the new moon energy and that's in pisces here and they're not having it they're not dealing with it they don't like the shit that they are doing and projecting negativity towards you and for that uh they try to creep up on you with the moon card because that looks like a fucking crab you guys ever see that crab that's in the in the in the water there you see that crab right there yeah, Virgos, that's a crab, all right? They trying to, they're trying to hurt you. They're trying to be deceptive on you, but you guys are so divinely protected. Your spirit guides are coming in to kick their ass. They're coming in, Virgos. It's going to be hitting them right back in their face. Yeah, two of wands. You guys are going to be good at the end of the day. The same ones that I said to you that are going to fuck them up, the ones that they're working with, the the low, the demon energies, are they going to be the same ones that are going to fuck them up? They're even going to, Oh, they are so obsessed with you, Virgos. They really are. I'm telling you, these people, they hate you, but they love you at the same time time because people who only attack people like this you must be sick in your fucking head eventually you're going to start loving the, the people that you're attacking what <laughs> continue to be successful virgo seven of pentacles continue to manifest continue to do your thing here at the same time and continue to prosper because you guys have a lot of success coming towards you guys you guys are good at the end of the day and these people they like i said they just want victory for themselves five of swords three of pentacles they only want what they want when they they're very narcissistic <laughs> very narcissistic behavior they don't want nobody else to win except for themselves that's why they're sitting right there and they want you to be right there but you guys are seeing everything for what it is you're seeing how how people can pretend how people can literally be and and you guys are not down for it. you guys are going to continue to work by yourself you're not going to bother you're not going to waste your time with people like this and you know virgos this is something that they're going to have to learn to change within themselves like they still have healing that they need to do from past trauma that they're not willing to heal. Yeah, you see that? They're not willing to heal. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This person doesn't want to heal. This person doesn't want to fix the traumas that they're dealing with with the Three of Swords, Four of Pentacles. They just want to simply take what's yours and they want to feed off of your energy. But you guys are always going to be safe and protected and you guys are always going to be good at the end of the day. These people got lots of fucking crazy energy around them, Virgos. They just want victory for themselves and you guys are going to continue to move on with your life with the Queen of Pentacles. Staying, staying by yourselves. These... Nothing is going to uh, affect you anymore, Virgos, in any way, shape, or form. You guys are going to literally, because you guys know what, you're, good, you're, you're very, very fucking good at what it is that you do. And during the new moon energy, you guys are going to have new journeys coming towards you guys. Some of you guys might be taking a trip at the same time. But, but all these people are in so much competition with you that they don't even know how to deal with you at this point because you continue to prosper. You continue to fucking still be sufficient within yourselves. And you're not, and you're holding, and you're holding yourself down. There could be a Gemini Libra Aquarius who sees you. And this person may have fucking hit you with spell work too, but they're but they're loving you. <laughs> they're loving you, though, Virgos. Someone they're starting to like, yo, trust me, oh Virgos, believe me. People are gonna start fucking loving you out of nowhere. And that's because their hate has turned into love because you guys are of love beings. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? So the same people, this Gemini Libra Aquarius who always hits you with magic, they are like it's like they're still they're watching you so much and it's like they're fascinated by you. Like how does this Virgo still hold themselves down after everything we've done to fuck her up or fuck him up? How come they this Virgo is still okay and that's because you guys are coming in as temperance you guys are just knowing your power you guys are very good at what it is that you guys do you guys are coming in as goddesses as well you guys got the biggest angels taking care of you and protecting you and spirit is going to be putting an end to these people with a death card right there they're going to have to put an end to them and uh, you guys are going to continue to prosper the universe is coming in putting an end to their bullshit and you guys are so smart, Virgo. You guys are just so fucking smart. And once this prosperity comes towards you with the Ace of Pentacles, watch your life start moving a lot more faster. Because once spirit, judgment, God, 
angel's divinity comes and steps in and fucks them up with a death card right there virgos and lets them know that yo you need to do some sort of shadow work you need to figure out why you have the the, the issues that you have <laughs> in your life and 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 why you are the way that you are so for that virgos spirit is going to come and put an end to this shit death card ace of pentacles you guys have a lot of prosperity a lot of money that's going to be coming towards you guys too and for that eight of wands Things are going to start picking up a lot more faster for you, Virgo. So congratulations for overcoming all the bullshit, all the obstacles, all the drama, all the competition, and all the wickedness that people have been bringing into your life. You should be very much so proud of yourselves, Virgos, because no matter what they've done to you, you guys are still continuing to mind your own business. You guys are still continuing to live your life, do your thing. You're not worried about nobody. This Nine of Pentacles, she's not worried about nobody. She, he, don't care. They're not worried about you. They're not worried about nobody else. This person here, no matter how much pain you bring onto this Nine of Pentacles life, they fucking nothing you. Do you understand what that means, how they nothing you? They fucking nothing you. They don't hate you. They don't love you. They just fucking simply nothing you. And how, can you imagine that somebody not nothinging you? <laughs> It's like a worthless type of feeling because they don't hate you. They don't love you. They just simply nothing you. You you are irrelevant. You're nothing for them. For them to even have any type of feelings, any type of nothing on them. All right? You guys are going to continue to prosper, Virgos. Congratulations. You guys got money. Things are going to start picking up a lot more faster for you too. Angels are working in your favor to take care of you, protect you, keep you safe. You guys also have your ancestors taking care of you at the same time. And this Empress, whoever the fuck she thinks she is, she might think that she's all that at the end of the day. But obviously she's not all that if she has to sit there and watch you 24-7 uh, to see how it is that you're moving. Because from what I'm seeing, this bitch is suffering. Suffering so badly with the Five of Cups. And she's going to regret the shit that she's done to you. She's also going to regret for getting other people involved because she's not only fucking with her life, she's also fucking with everybody else's life. Thanks, cuties. Bye.